really can't do, which is pretty fantastic. Um, I, yeah, I, it's like uh, it's like Celine Dion, uh, you know, Celine playing <laughs> a casino in Las Vegas for you know six months or so. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. exactly. They're they're having a, they're in residence at the Amway Arena, and uh, I I feel like it gave them it just the, the I feel like from a creative perspective, it gave the the company an emotional lift. Like I felt that lift even a little bit on a Friday night watching mm-hmm. SmackDown because I mean I couldn't resist you know peeking in and seeing it and you could just tell like the energy was stronger from the performers everything felt like it had a little bit more juice and and maybe it is just you know putting them back into a larger setting Mm -hmm. um pumping in that crowd noise um how much of it is authentic is you know give or take here or there but i i felt like they um I, I feel like for the most part, it's having a very positive impact on the product. Mm-hmm. It's making it feel like an actual wrestling show again. Absolutely. And what's the difference between, you know, having the NXT extras in the crowd, you know, trying to play fans and actually having fans is a big, is a big difference, especially, you know, they're live again. Um, there are actual fans there who will cause trouble from time to time. Uh, yes, uh, you know yes. and that element of danger is back, uh, even if they are confined to their little screens. And uh, you know we'll, we'll see um, how well it works and how much of the rough edges they can smooth off. Um, I thought SummerSlam was a huge success. I thought tonight was a little bit of a step back, but I feel like they had hmm. so much momentum coming off a of Sunday yeah. that it. Yeah didn't even matter i'm you know still kind of buzzing just it's nice to see the industry leader kind of has a little bit of swagger back because you know those last few weeks or months at the Mm -hmm. pc were Mm -hmm. were a drag 